It's the time of year for pride, and you know what that means. Corporate rainbow logos everywhere. I think I'd rather you just call me a slur. Rainbow capitalism is this extreme commercialization and commercial exploitation of the queer identity. When you have a um, organization um, like a, a large bank, say J.P. Morgan, then get to appear as a benevolent and fun and reaffirming and supportive organization, that helps their image. support the gays but hey queer baiting pays when it matters they don't make a sound if you still want to paint your corporate logo rainbow colors fine number one you have to have pulled out of all states that have passed anti-LGBTQ and anti-trans legislation. So no more offices in states like Texas and Alabama. Number two, you have to have ended all donations to anti-trans and anti-LGBTQ politicians. Have you noticed that there's plenty of companies that didn't really say a darn thing about the Don't Say Gay Bill in Florida, yet all have beautiful pride merchandise all dropping right now. So, um... Just remember to support those that support us. Thanks, have a great day. Hi, gay. Happy Pride Month. We are sashaying away with deals. We love gay, and it's awesome. We also make candles now. Wouldn't a candle be nice for gay stuff? Immediately obsessed that somebody decided to throw a derogatory word on a shirt for Pride Month. And I want to say the design here was lacking, but honestly, it would probably feel worse if they'd actually put effort into this. Of course, we've got the pronoun t-shirt for my favorite demographic of people who use all pronouns and then the plural us. This was a protest slogan used during the AIDS crisis, and the fact that Target is just going to slap that on a shirt and sell it for profit to millions of people... Ugh... I can confirm you are not having a stroke. This is $110 for a wearable version of the rug from your kindergarten classroom. So impactful. This will haunt my dreams. If you're a small business and you want to support the community, that's great, but it needs to be said. If you are not a member of the LGBTQIA plus community and you are selling pride products for a profit, especially, especially if you're only doing so around pride month, you are participating in rainbow capitalism. Do you know how amazing it is for kids to be able to go into these stores and see themselves represented, even if just for a month? My favorite part of rainbow capitalism is every June on Facebook watching all the brands and sports teams and TV shows, etc., change their icons. And then you read the comments and the bigots are just losing their minds. 